Uh, worried about relying on Verrett and Reed. Well, let's talk about Verrett. I'm surprised the Niners kept only five cornerbacks because that's one of the weakest positions on the team. Now it has no depth. Last year they had six with DJ Reed. Reed could play every position in the defensive backfield. Now they have two backup corners, and one of them has played appeared in six games since 2015. That was the Obama administration. This dude has played six games since Trump took office. I mean, Trump could get voted out before this guy plays the seventh game. Seriously. So that's where we're at in the defensive backfield. I don't like it. But, I mean, they cut Tim Harris Jr. That guy's never made a play that I've seen in his life. So I'm not mad. The other guy, Jared Baden, I liked him. He's going to make the practice squad. They can cut him up whenever they, they can call him up whenever they want. So it's not that they cut someone in their defensive backfield that they needed. It just shows how barren that position is, corner especially. Maybe they should draft a corner next year. I'm going to write a letter in cursive so they take it serious. These days, people don't, people don't write cursive anymore. It's just a it, – it really is a shame. Who was the one deserving player who got cut today? The C.J. Beathard game. Who got cut – that shouldn't have because C.J. Beathard is on the team? It's a good question. I can't think of anyone off the top of my head. No offensive. Deion Jordan? No. Kevin White? No. I mean, uh, mm, it's a tough one. Yeah, it would have to be like a rookie. Harold, Hasty, Maiden. So I don't have a problem with the Niners keeping C.J. Beathard over those undrafted rookies because all those guys are all going to get signed to the practice squad and the Niners aren't going to lose them. So, um, and I guess it's possible someone would pick up C.J. Beathard, although they won't. But at least the Niners probably will get to keep all of them. So every year I'm like, not, they better not cut someone and lose someone because they wanted to keep Beathard. But I don't think they will this year. It seems like they always kind of find a spot for him. So we'll see. Ooh, which practice squad players do you think will be called up for every game? That's a tough one. You guys have some ideas. Go ahead and throw them out. Hmm. Ooh, practice squad guys who could get called up. I don't think it's going to be Jamichael Hasty because they already have four tailbacks on the roster. They're not going to be like, I need a fifth tailback just in case. Like, no. Um, another tight end? No. Maybe another defensive lineman. They usually keep 10 defensive linemen. Now they only have nine. They could call up Darian Daniels. They could call up Darian Daniels. They could call up Hronis Grasu, an offensive lineman. They could call up Jonathan Cyprian, Jared Maiden, probably Maiden, Cif Cyprian, Kevin White. I mean, if Kevin White agrees to be on the practice squad, wouldn't they kind of have to say, that, hey, man, we won't be active, but we'll call you up.